Hey guys, okay, so I start school in three days. Let's get rid of my acne in three days. Everyone gets acne, it's a normal thing, but I'm gonna fight for my life tonight because I was cut off. I just wanna have clear skin for my first day, so let me show you my blemishes. Okay, I don't have the beauty filter on, but as you can see on my forehead, and over there, so yeah. Okay, so I already washed my face with like the youth to the people cleanser. Now I'm gonna put a hot rag on my face and open up my pores. Took off the towel. Maybe you can see my skin better like this. Now we're gonna pop. Finish popping, rewash my face. Okay, I just rewashed and this is how we're looking. This toner, I just do a pump and then go like that. Okay, I think I need more moisture, so I'm gonna use the Superberry Hydrate and Glow Dream Mask. Take that much, go like this, this, this. It does have a scent, which is kind of alarming, but I think it'll be fine. Now, applying a, a pimple patch to this one because it hasn't come to the surface yet. I'm gonna watch TV and go to bed, update you in the morning. Morning, it's currently 6.46. Get ready with me for my first day of school, of high school. Let's wash my face cause oh, I look busted. Toner and moisturizer. Okay, now I think I should have something to eat and maybe like a coffee. Okay, so we had orientation yesterday for the freshmen, which it's so embarrassing that I'm a freshman. Like that's the first problem about this entire situation. Second problem is that there was only like other freshmen there. And now we have to go to the school with the seniors today, which like, I'm not scared. Anyhow, I'm gonna make oatmeal for breakfast. Also, do you guys think I should bring my own lunch or get a lunch there? I'm vegetarian, so I don't know what kind of options they're gonna have for me. It's a little watery. <laughs> okay, I finished my makeup, but since I was crying so hard last night, I have a double eyelid, which I've never experienced this before. But let's change in my outfit. <laughs> perfume and deodorant. I'm using this perfume. Since it is glass, I'm not gonna take it in my bag. I'm gonna take um, just like a plastic one from Bath and Body Works. Jewelry. Okay, brush my teeth. Also, I knew my eyelashes were gonna be bad. I think I said earlier in this video, and if I didn't, I meant to say that my eyelashes were gonna look bad. Back problems. Okay, hashtag in my brother's room, which I miss them because they're in Mexico before going back to college. Anyhow, fit check. This top. I think it's from Urban, I'm not sure. These pants I bought on Depop. These shoes, which are like dusty old Air Forces with SpongeBob on the side, are from Drip Creations. This necklace is Corinne's that she left in my house, but my house is four hours away, so I can't give her, give Corinne her necklace, but instead I'm gonna live in her honor today. Anyhow, this ring was, I think, my mom's. And my backpack is my brother's that he uses for college, but I, I, I didn't go back to school shopping, so I had to use it. Also, why am I getting like a rash? I'm now in the car on the way. Also, I would like to say I did film me doing my entire like makeup routine, but it deleted just watching back, so I don't know what happened. Okay, it's currently Friday, so I've had two official days of my freshman year, and it wasn't bad. I like my classes. Why did I just open up to make a new video and this happened to my face? What's going on? Anyhow, it's Christmas, actually. Fit. But I want to wake up in cute pajamas. So let's pick out my pajamas for Christmas. I have a lot of PJs, so let's see. So I obviously have to, sleep. I obviously have to wear one that's Christmassy. I have these ski pants with a matching like ski top, which I think these are super cute and big and comfy. I also have these llamas that are Christmas themed, but they don't look very Christmas themed, so I don't know if I'm going to wear those. These would be my option, but there's a hole right in the spot, so. These are my pajamas from when I was like five. They still fit me. They have cats rocking out. I can't find the top to my ski pajamas. I could wear a tank top, but that kind of seems like a loser moment. Is it ratchet to put on a Naruto shirt backwards and wear it? This is what I'm wearing. Hey Vogue, it's Sarah, and today I'm going to be sharing with you my beauty secrets, my face, makeup, and hair routine. So I start off by washing my face, and then I'm going to go in with my toner, my serum, and my moisturizer. Now 
Now with my moisturizer, I'm going to be really careful because I get super oily throughout the day. And girl, if that back camera's on me, I don't want to be oily. Now that we're glowing, let's get into makeup. Okay, I'm going to start with my Tarte Creaseless Concealer. And I'm going to take it right under my eye like this. Um, I have a funny story about this concealer, so... I never liked concealer because I don't have bad under eyes, but I do have mascara stains. It's a real thing, and it really truly is a struggle. The attic areas, and I vote that we cancel them. Okay, so recently I've been loving a big bushy brow with my blonde hair. Um, It looks a little yellow right now because I feel like it just makes my brown eyes pop with it, so that's what I'm going to do. This is the NYX Professional Tinted Brow Mascara in Brunette. You literally just swipe this through your brows like a normal mascara. I love it. Okay, so since it's winter, I'm living for cooler tones. I just feel like just like a cute like little snow frostbite moment is everything to me right now. So I'm just going to take this light pink tart blush that complements my skin. Okay, so I don't put on bronzer because it's winter, unrealistic expectations, but I'm just going to powder under my eye and where my face will be greasy with the same blush brush. Now I'm going to take a brown shade and a brush like this and just go across my nose to make a button nose. For highlight, I use the Ofra highlighter, and this is the retrograde shade, and it's like a pink. I think that pink highlighter is so pretty because it can kind of almost give this like purpley, like out of this world effect to your cheeks. So it's just adorable. Okay, I'm so oily that literally my eyelids, my eyelids get oily, so I just put a little bit of some white powder on those just to kind of set them. So I do a different eye look almost every single day, but I really like this natural one, so I think I'm just gonna deepen my corner. So just like that, I deepened it so my eye looks more connected. Okay, now I'm going to curl my eyelashes with the Tweezerman Eyelash Curler, and I cannot stress this enough. This is my favorite eyelash curler. I have had a battle with my lashes since I've been little. Um, since I was like 10 years old, I've been obsessed with having long eyelashes, and I've never accomplished it until I've had this. All right, there's a L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. I like to kind of fan out my eyelashes this way and then this way to make them look wider. All right, and now lastly, lips. I'm going to go in with this LA Girl Perfect Precision Lip Liner. And I don't overline a lot, just on my lip line. Alright, now this NYX lip gloss. You know, I've always been told that I have, like, smaller lips, and I agree, don't get me wrong. Like, I don't mind having smaller lips, because I can overline them. And now I'll brush my hair, because it's a wrap. Alright, this is in bad lighting, but thank you guys so much for having me. I love you. Mwah. Bye. Your kick kick is like ice, so it's cold, but I don't care.